Welcome to Union Lutheran Church's Midweek Devotions. We gather in the image of the Creator, who is a community of love. We gather in the name of the Redeemer, who reconciles all creation. We gather in the presence of the life giver, who inspires new life and renews it. Hear now the words of Psalm 47. Clap your hands, all you nations. Shout to God with cries of joy, for the Lord Most High is awesome, the great King over all the earth. He subdued nations under us, peoples under our feet. He chose our inheritance for us, the pride of Jacob, whom he loved. God has ascended amid shouts of joy, the Lord amid the shouts of trumpets. Sing praises to God, sing praises. Sing praises to our King, sing praises. For God is the King of all the earth, sing to him a psalm of praise. God reigns over the nations. God is seated on the holy throne. The nobles of the nations assemble as the people of God of Abraham. For the kings of the earth belong to God. He is greatly exalted. And let us pray. Praise be to the Holy Trinity. God is sound and life, creator of the universe, source of all life, whom the angels sing, wondrous light of all mysteries known to unknown, to humankind, and life that lives in all. Thanks be to God. Amen. I share with you a reading from Philippians. I thank my God every time I remember you constantly praying with joy in every one of my prayers for all of you because of your sharing in the gospel from the first day until now i am confident of this the one who began a good work among you will bring it to completion by the day of jesus christ it is right for me to think this way about all of you because you hold me in your heart for all of you share in god's grace with me both in my imprisonment in the defense and conf confirmation of the gospel. For God is my witness, how I long for all of you with compassion of Christ Jesus. And this is my prayer, that your love may overflow more and more with knowledge and full insight to help you determine what is best, so that in the day of Christ you may be pure, blameless, having produced the harvest of righteousness that comes through Jesus Christ. And let us join in prayer. Praise be you, O God, for the gift of your creation. Help us always to appreciate it anew and to care for it in faithful stewardship. You are with us. Remain with us. God of peace, you promise peace to all nations. We pray for your peace to prevail. Open ways for life abundant for all. Strength and sustain the churches in their task of being messengers and instruments of peace. You are with us. Remain with us. God of strength and comfort, we pray for all victims of violence and injustice in our world. May justice, reconciliation, and hope become possible in the midst of hate and hurt. You are with us. Remain with us. God of healing, in the wake of the COVID-19 global pandemic, hear our cries for healing for all who are sick, for their families. Hear our cries for all those suffering from the many diseases for which we do not have a cure. Hear our cries for the doctors and nurses who care for them. In your compassion, heal our world and all your creatures. You are with us. Remain with us. God, our refuge, we pray for your protection in our work for our colleagues in church world services. We pray for their safety as they minister in areas which expose them to heightened risk. Sustain and encourage them. You are with us. Remain with us. Creator God, during the season of creation, 
Grant us the courage to observe a Sabbath for our planet. Strengthen us with faith to trust in your providence. You are with us. Remain with us. God of the earth, we pray for areas that are affected by wildfires, by hurricanes. Use us to reach out to those in need, to care for them. You are with us. Remain with us. Inspiring God, stir in us the creativity to share what we have been given. Teach us to be satisfied with enough. Send your Holy Spirit to renew the face of the ground. You are with us. Remain with us. Amen. And Lord, remember us in your kingdom as you taught us to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as is in, is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Save us in the time of trial, and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. Go in peace. Serve the Lord. Thanks be to God.